What's up, guys? This is Parker from the Fast Foodies Podcast, back with another review. Oh, and if you're liking these reviews, make sure to smash that subscribe button and turn on post notifications so you don't miss upcoming reviews. It also helps out this channel. But anyway, on to the review. Just got back from the gym, you know, pumping some iron, making some gains. So, time to refuel some protein. Still within that anabolic window, I think. But anyway, Today, I'm excited for this review. We're gonna be trying out a protein bar. More specifically, the MCT Cookie Dough Protein Bar. Now, I've had quite a few of MCT bars, and I've got to say, I think all of them have ranked above a 7.5. They've been really good. And I'll actually link a playlist up here, that, up here somewhere, that you can check out, and check out all their flavors. And if you the flavors sound good to you, then you can head on over and pick up a box of six and just pay for shipping. All their protein bars have no added sugar and use collagen protein. Let's get into the taste test. This is what the bar looks like. As you can see, it's got like chocolate chips in there. So I think it's gonna be a chocolate chip cookie dough flavor. I'm excited for this. Cut off a piece. That's pretty nice. Similar to the other bars, which I was hoping for actually, kind of dissolves when you bite into it. So it's a protein bar, but when you when it does dissolve, it almost turns into that cookie dough that it says it's gonna be, which I really enjoy. Those chocolate chips also add a nice crunch to it. So it's got a textual, mm, textual component as well. Nice bits of chocolate in there. It does have a slight protein aftertaste. However, it's definitely not strong at all, and you can hardly notice it. The the main flavor is definitely that signature cookie dough flavor that everybody knows and loves. It's nice because it's edible too, so it's not like you have to bake this or anything. You can just eat it whenever. However, now I'm gonna try to microwave it because I microwaved two other other bars and both times it's turned like soft and gooey and hoping that with this cookie dough flavor, it will pretty much turn into a high protein edible cookie dough when I microwave it, but I'll be right back. So I found that microwaving these bars for about 22 seconds is the right amount of time for my microwave at least. And I actually had to grab a fork because after it came out of the microwave, it got gooey, so I couldn't pick it up. Yeah. Melting it just takes it, or not melting it, but putting it in the microwave takes it to a whole nother level. That's good. Oh, and those chocolate chips. It's a dark chocolate, actually, I think. It's definitely not your normal sweet chocolate, which I really, because the bar itself is pretty sweet, but then you get that nice kind of rich chocolate flavor from those chocolate chips. Ooh, that hit, that really hit me right there. I like that a lot. So let's get on to the ratings. Now I'm gonna give this two ratings. I'm gonna give it just how it is out of the package, and then I'll give it a microwave rating. So after I put it in the microwave for a bit. So I'm gonna give the MCT cookie dough flavor bar, just how it is, an eight out of 10. However, after microwaving it, microwaving this bar had even a bigger impact than microwaving the banana bar, which I think that it raised the banana's score from an 8.5 to 9.5, but it's gonna raise this from an eight to a 9.5 out of 10. Microwaving this, it just, it turned it into a cookie dough flavor. Honestly, it's, it's edible cookie dough <laughs> when you microwave it, but. Another solid bar from MCT, and like I mentioned, if any of these bars sound good to you, head on over to their website, pick up a box for six, just pay for shipping. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. If you want to hear more, check out Fast Foodies Podcast on Apple Podcasts and Spotify.